Hi, it's Martin Ayres from Secret Golf here. Today I'm going to talk about how to hit a Stinger 3-iron. The number one thing that's going to help you to hit this shot is you have a clear picture of the shot in mind. So if you were to go out there on the range and just try to hit a 3-iron full, uh, but try and keep it 10 feet off the ground, for example, that's going to guide you into where you need to be probably better than I'm able to do just by uh, this instruction. Generally, to hit the ball low, most people will say to get the ball to go back in the stance. And that will be true. It will generally help you hit down on the ball more. But we also don't want to get too steep with a club like a three iron. So one of the things that I like to do to alleviate some of that steepness and yet still get myself to hit it on the down blow so that I can hit the ball low is to open up and to widen up. Now, normally if I was to get a little open and wider, that would make me hit the ball higher. So these two things kind of counteract each other in a way, but I want you to understand that those, those rules and so on, because the opening and widening and being slightly further from the ball is a sort of shallowing move. By having those things in play, I can then move the ball very far back in my stance, and the wider and further from the ball, I can still make a big swing and hit the ball low, which is what we're looking to do with a three iron. We want to still hit it a full three iron distance. Those are the things that I would do if I'm just going to get up there and, and visualize a shot that I'm hitting with my three iron about 10 feet off the ground. And as I said, if I just simply move the ball back, that would not be enough for me. That would be now too steep. And so the, the other two things that I'll do will help counteract some of that steepness, but still allow me to hit the ball low. So I'll just demonstrate that right here. So I hope that helps you with that shot, and I hope you enjoy your golf. This has been Martin Ayres.